What's up, guys? So, we're back with a another sub-story for, of course, The Elder Scrolls Online. You guys clicked on the video, you guys know exactly because of the title and the thumbnail, of course. And, because of that, you already know it's on the Orsinium DLC. I think this is part of the base game. You guys can correct me in the comment section if I'm incorrect on that. Uh, they made it into the base game now or whatever, but I still wanted to cover it because there's characters that are introduced in this DLC that are gonna be a part of later DLCs. So I kind of wanted to, you know, actually get a grasp of who these people are uh, from a character standpoint. And I wanted to see if I can actually get attached to them and everything like that through the progression of their story arcs or their involvement in the story, if you will. I'm very excited to get this started. I have played through the DLC, but I didn't pay attention to any of the story because I'm saving the story as far as actually digesting what it's all about for the channel. And of course, here we are. I'm super excited for this though, and uh, I did want to say though, I have made some minor adjustments to this character uh, that I'm going to be showing you right now actually. Uh, I actually upgraded everything. Except for this, the legendary, I kind of ran out of resources. And, of course, my weapons. So, it's all it's all legendary now. I still need to get a monster set for this tune. But, I will probably do that off uh, off of the uh, off the channel. If you guys want to see me, you know, grind for some monster sets, let me know down in the comment section down below. If not, I will definitely do that off the channel. But, uh, with that being said... I'm excited to get this started, guys. If you are too, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So, with that being said, enough yapping. Let's go ahead and jump right into this. Alrighty. So, we've made it. There's a dead body right here. Is this the start of this zone's questline? Orsinium Messenger. Alright. The corpse carries an official-looking letter. This letter is addressed to you. That's not strange at all. Take the letter. So, invitation to Orsinium. I'm assuming that is a quest item? Yes, it is. So, let's go ahead and use it. Oh, God, I got some reading to do. So, bear with me, guys. I'm a terrible reader, but apparently this is a part of the quest line. So, I'm going to read it. Amerigamer, or AG for short. Accept this invitation, carried by one of my most trusted messengers. Well, he's dead now. Sorry there, buddy. In friendship and respect. In the name of the mighty... King Kurog, I bid you welcome and invite you to test your metal in the wilds of majestic Rothgar. The Orsimer, those are orcs, are uh, care not uh, your loyalties lie. Care not where your lo loyalties lie. Come help us rebuild the city of Orsinium and squelch the winterborn menace. Aid the king and his worthy endeavors and riches and favors will be bestowed upon you. I have sent uh, Ambassador Lasgara to meet you and offer you transportation to the Rothgar. You can find her in the following cities. Daggerfall, Davin's Watch, or Volkilgard. Look for her when you arrive. I look forward to meeting you in person as I've heard such wonderful accounts of your adventures present uh present yourself to me when you arrive in orsinium forge mother alga orsinium rothgar okay so that's it i apologize again for my absolutely terrible reading i don't have to go apparently to daggerfall or any of the other places that it said because the message i mean the uh, quest marker shows that it's over here so that's good going on here I didn't come all this way to die elf that isn't what I signed up for Damn hey it. where are all these winterborn marauders coming from anyone see where the chief and his warriors went anyone I like I like this character an ice hearts damn winterborn a whole lot of winterborn <clears throat> is that it okay Evelie sharp arrow Did Orsinium send you are you part of the reinforcements? The Winterborn came out of nowhere. It happened so fast. They took our cargo into the hills and the Orc peasants chased them. 
That's when Chief Basrog and his warriors arrived. So, okay, really quick. Slow down and tell me exactly what happened. Also, who are the Winterborn? Our caravan was heading for Orsinium, the new Orc city, when the Winterborn landed on the wagons like flesh flies on Skiba Pie. The Orc peasants refused to let their supplies be taken, so they chased the marauders into the hills. Uh, you let defenseless peasants go after the marauders? In case you haven't noticed, these cracked acorns aren't worth their weight in bloodberry pudding. Besides, before we could rally our forces, Chief Basrog and his orc warriors arrived. He told us to wait here and then went after the marauders. Oh no. He might be in serious danger. I'll go help the chief then. I know I liked you the moment I saw you. Chief Basrog is big and mean and looks like he can fight. But there are an awful lot of marauders. Iceheart's Winterborn won't stop until Basrog and all the orc peasants are dead. You better hurry. Aren't you coming with me? I will. Eventually. Maybe. I mean, look around. These people are injured. Okay, that's fair. What happens if the Winterborn come back? Someone has to protect them. Keep them from being picked off <laughs> one by one. Anyway, I'll keep them safe while you help Chief Basrog. Yeah, no, I, I agree. Somebody definitely has to stay behind and, you know, help these people. But anyways, really quick. Uh, what can you tell me about the chief? He's a chief. In charge of an orc clan or something. If you ask me, he's got more than a chip on his shoulder. It's a whole damn mountain. I don't think he's a big supporter of King Korog, but he saved us before he went to help the peasants. Was the chief part of your caravan? No. We were the caravan guards. Got it. Basrog said he was on patrol, looking for Winterborn marauders. Some scary reach warlord named Iceheart leads them. Even Basrog seemed a bit nervous just talking about him. Now go help the chief before it's too late. Okay. Really quick, though. I am very curious. What brings a wood elf to the Rothgar anyways? This caravan brought me. I thought we already covered that. Okay, I meant... Oh, you mean specifically... Exactly. The invitation. You got one too, didn't you? It talked about testing yourself against the most savage land in Tamriel. That was a challenge I couldn't pass up. Oh, she's a warrior. Alright. Too easy, thank you. So, okay, how far is this? It is not far at all. We're actually here already. Oh, hello. Here, happy birthday. Also, oh, uh, sit your butt down. Oh, I forgot to mention, I did... Really quick, before I continue, I did change my build quite significantly. It's still a hybrid build, but one side is Magicka and one side is Stamina. So my front bar is all Stamina, and my back bar is all Magicka. So I'm quite literally a hybrid. And now, this place, so much better. I got, you know, dual wielding in the front. And then a staff in the back, and oh my god, dude, I'm loving it so far. Nice. And my sustained significantly improved, because once, like, my, my, you know, say my stamina's all ran out, I just swap, quickly swap to my other, uh, my other bar, and then I'm literally refreshed. And while this is going on, I just, you know, my other side my stamina side if you will is recharging so it just works out Keep your head perfectly down and don't move who's this Chief Bosrog will be back for the rest of us as soon as he can we found them leave no orc alive <gasps> oh snap uh. oh no they're coming from everywhere sit your butt down is that it there's more of them watch out Oh, I see him. Don't worry. Oh, I didn't even see this dude. This dude's literally just running beside me. Like it's nothing. Ah! Oh. Thanks for the help. We'll head back to the caravan. Stupid to come out here on our own anyway. Who said that? Was that you? There are okay. still some of us hiding in the cave near the waterfall. Is this... Is this it? Well, this is a... Oh, okay. I almost jumped down. Oh, this is... Oh, I don't know who this is. 
I saw what you did out there. Thanks for helping the clan orcs. The ones in here? I think it's too late to help them. Ice heart. He froze them solid. The bastards got magic the likes of which I've never seen. So you're one of the uh, you're one of Cheese Bosrog's soldiers? Yes. I'm with Bosrog. We were out on patrol when we saw the Winterborn attack the caravan. By the time we reached the wagons, the marauders had already stolen the supplies, and a group of orc peasants were trying to chase them down. Okay. So, rewind a little bit. Who is this Iceheart that you're speaking about? You're Fawn Iceheart. He's the most powerful of the Winterborn warlords that have been raiding Rothgar the past few years. Since he arrived from the Reach, the attacks have gotten worse. Iceheart is strong, ambitious, and extremely dangerous. Alright, no worries. I'm not even worried about it. I can deal with Iceheart. I like your courage. But I don't think you'll get to test it today. I will. If Iceheart was still around, we'd be frozen solid by now. My guess? He got what he wanted and hightailed it out of here. <laughs> A shame, really. The outlying clans need those supplies. Uh, the supplies from the caravan, I'm assuming? Enough food and supplies to get the outlying clans through the winter. Without those supplies, the clans are going to starve. That's Chief Bosrog went to track down the marauders and find the supplies. If he fails, I don't know what we're going to do. So, how can I help? Search the area and see if you can find anything that even hints as to where the marauders disappeared to. If you happen to pick up their trail, find Chief Bosrog. He'll know what to do. Okay, sounds like a plan then. Leave no stone unto Anything you uncover. Will do. Also, these people got absolutely obliterated. This guy was begging. Oh, that's so sad. This ice heart definitely has to pay. 1999 plus tax and shipping. Oh, I didn't even see you. Hello. What's up? You want some? Aha! Alright, so we got three different locations. Go ahead and... Dunzo. I don't know what I was doing, to be honest. I'm still getting used to this build. Alright? So, don't judge me. Sit your butt down! Who's this? Don't even think it! These supplies belong to the Winterborn now! Nobody cares about the Winterborn, guy! Why can't you understand that? Do will increase to seven. Yeah, I'm brand new to this build if you can't tell. Do I want to read this? No, I don't. You guys can definitely push pause if you guys want to read it, though. At least I found what I was going looking for. If I jump, will I die? Not if I... Oh, okay. Well, I almost died anyways. Oh, we're almost here. It's actually... We're actually getting to Orsinium. That's gotta... That, yeah, that's definitely Orsinium. Hey, Chief Barsrog! The clan peasants. Are they on their way to Orsinium? The soldiers escorted them and the wounded outsiders. They should be safe enough. Safe enough isn't good enough. Go after them. I'll continue to look for the Winterborn and the missing supplies. That's it? <laughs> You're the outsider who leaped into the bear's den to fight the Winterborn? Uh-huh. Oh, Shard, the wood elf, mentioned you. Surprised you didn't end up all bruised and bloody like the rest of these fools. This is our home, not an amusement for your pleasure. Okay, well, I saved your people. And I appreciate that. Doesn't change the fact that I despise that you're here, though. Sticking your nose in our business. Well, that was rude. I was invited, guy. Ah, uh, yes. The king's invitation. And what a royal bag of snakes that is. Look, you have my thanks for saving those people. 
as much as I hate it, I owe you a favor. But right now, I need to determine where they took the stolen supplies. Maybe this note will help you find those supplies that you're looking for. Let me see that. We've been betrayed, and for gold, no less. By Malakath, I'll make sure someone pays for this. Look, I need to protect the next caravan to come through the Merchant's Gate. If you truly want to help Rothgar, then you will help me. Uh, sure, what do you want me to do? This note indicates that the traitor has interests in the city. I want you to track down this traitor and find our stolen shipments. The fastest way to get on my good side, and on Kurog's, is to expose the traitor and recover our supplies. Okay, I'll go to Orsinium and see what I can uh, learn. I suggest you start your search in the inn. Gold and dark dealings often go hand in hand with drinking and celebrating. Agreed. Don't disappoint me. I hate putting my trust in outsiders. Do everyone a favor and prove me wrong. So, I do have some questions for you, Chief Bosrog. What exactly are you the chief of? I'm the chief of the foreign <clears throat> clan. One of the oldest and strongest clans in all of Rothgar. Kurog makes it sound like tradition is a bad thing. But by Malakath's broken tooth, tradition is the lifeblood of our culture. It's who we are. I mean, I can't argue against that. That's what you guys believe, you know? And I, I kind of agree. Uh, so that's why you're giving me so much grief? You're a long way from home. Sticking your nose where it doesn't belong. It's a good way to get it cut off, at least in my stronghold. Still, Malakath would call me a fool if I turned down help when it was freely offered. That's fair. Uh, but, I mean, going back to the conversation at hand, though, why would somebody betray the Orc clans? Unfortunately, not even Orcs are immune to greed. War provides too many opportunities for those willing to trade in lives and suffering. Gold. It turns brother against brother. Fact. We were better off when we bought it for everything we needed. So what should I look for in the city? Look for anything that would link this traitor to the note you found. Someone with a lot of gold to spend would be a good start. Then there are the Khajiiti traders that were mentioned. How many of the cat people could there be in Orsinium? Six. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I don't know. Alright, thank you. Hey, Emily. The others went on ahead to the city, in case you're wondering. I, um, felt kind of responsible for sending you into harm's way. So I waited around to make sure you were alright. And here you are, Aww. right as rain. Aw, she cares. So what's a wood elf doing in this place, uh, in a place like this? Anyways, she already answered this. Same as all the others, looking for adventure. I figured there wasn't a better place to make a name for myself than in the untamed wilderness of Rothgar. Are you going to Orsinium? Yeah, actually, I need to present myself to Forge Mother Alga. Ah, King Kurog's mother. She's oh. one smart woman and an even smarter orc. From what I've heard, you want to stay on a good side. I understand she has a fierce temper. What about you? Are you going to Arsenium? Eventually. But first they asked me to go to Frostbreak Fortress. I think they realized I was good with the bow and they need something filled with arrows. Hopefully it's more of these Winterborn. Who knows? Maybe I'll see you there. Maybe you will. Goodbye. Well, that was interesting. We have a side quest right here, but I'm not going to take it, though. Because I want to focus on the main story. So, how do I get in there? Do I just continue following this? It looks like it kind of wraps around right here. Oh, snap. I almost ran right off. <laughs> I almost ran right off the... The, uh... What's it called? The bridge there. Alright, so this is where it wraps around. Yeah, this is the entrance to Orsinium. And we are supposed to go in there. Yeah, this is the end. So we're going literally exactly where the chief wanted us to go to. 
Orsinium Guards. This place looks dope. I definitely need to train. Hello. I don't have gold. So, there's that. I should have transferred some gold over to this character. But, I didn't. I used it all up actually fast traveling here. It was expensive. It was like 800 gold or something. And that's all I had. It's not like I had a lot of gold on this tune anyways. Alright. Hello. Visit or send you a... Okay. The Mazab something house. I can never read orcish names. So what am I looking for? I should probably have this. Oh, it's upstairs. Is this a secret base? And with interest? About time. Wait. How do I... How do I get to him? I'm not sure. I'm kind of confused. Uh, oh, there's... I mean, I guess if I would have just looked around, I would have saw that there were stairs here. All right, hello. Hello. Okay, I'm going around. Hello. It definitely appears like okay. It's a good day, friend. I've got gold in my pocket and a full mug in my hand. So what can I do for you? I mean, I couldn't overhear. Uh, help, but overhear. What was uh that about a large amount of gold? My game's gonna crash, guys. Because of course it is. It's ESO. Full mug okay. in my hand. I couldn't help it over here. Blah blah blah. I, do? I don't see how that's any of your business. And if you're thinking of trying to rob me, well, think again. I need this gold for my daughter. Now leave me be, or I'll, I'll hit you with my mug. <laughs> Dude, I am a mighty warrior. To be fair, though, you are an orc. And you guys are great and skillful warriors yourself. But you're not much of a warrior, are you? I'm just trying to find someone who came across a large amount of gold recently. That's that's all I'm trying to do, man. I don't want to fight you. Oh, why didn't you just say so? Being all mysterious and scaring a person half to death? So, why are you looking for Gulag? He just told us. Uh, I need to find out uh, how he got the gold. My Trinimax deformed toe, if this gold <laughs> is illegal, my shield high needs her potions. All right, let's try this. If you forget all about what we were discussing, then I might have information that will help you. Do you agree? Perhaps. What discussion? I didn't hear a thing. Right, right, you never heard this from me, but Gulag left here a little while ago to talk to those Kashyyyk traders. You know, the ones who showed up recently? And if nothing else, you should be able to smell them. Smell them? He wears some kind of fancy fragrance, says it keeps the spirits docile. The Got Khajiit it. sold it to him. If you ask me, it smells like a dead horker left out too long in the sun. Follow that scent and it'll lead you right to him. Tracking, thank you. You know, why am I not surprised that the Khajiit are involved in some shady trading businesses or transactions? How do I get out of here again? Was it this way? No, it was this way. There we go. This place is a little confusing. There's a lot of people in here. Does that say above? Yeah, it does. There we go. Orsidium. So we definitely got some shadiness going on. How far is this? Up. Oh, this is gonna hurt. With the great shackle Not a lot. destroyed, has the plane melded? Whoa, stopped? dude. This literally looks like he's crop dusting the hell out of everybody. Like he just let one rip and now it's following him. I call that a crop dust. This is oh Khajiit right here. Good It's almost enough to make this one want to stop dealing with him. Arusha would agree. Except for all the gold he gave us. 
He's got the luck of Joan and Jode. Even if he smells like a dead horker. <laughs> this one hopes we are blessed with half his luck and twice his gold. But not his scent. Oh, okay. So now we're going this direction. Follow the dead horker scent is essentially what we're doing. Also known as crop dust. Follow the crop dust until there is no more crops to, to dust. I'm like all up in this. It is seeping into my veins. I'm gonna smell like butt after this. Oh, hello. Oofgill's bathhouse and laundry. This bath um, is ours for as long as we want. I paid in advance. You didn't have two gold pieces to rub together last time I saw you, Gulag. What chain? Gulag. Wait, how do I get down there? There it is. And who might you Oh my be? god. Go find another bathhouse. I hired this one for the entire day. I'll let you deal with this, Gulag, darling. I'm going to go and get something to drink. Is she, a, is she a prostitute? What's this about? If you aren't here to use the baths, it must be about my tonics. Well, I can assure you, my tonics are guaranteed to cure whatever ails you. It just takes time. And... And multiple applications. <laughs> multiple applications? Okay. Tell me about the deal you made with the Winterborn. What? I, I have no idea what you're talking oh, about. Oh, don't act dumb. I'm a loyal subject of the king. I, I don't have anything to do with any damn Winterborn. Uh, as a matter of fact, you do. This letter to Ulfram Iceheart says otherwise. No, I, I can explain. Try. The people of this city. I made a deal for them. Gold from the Winterborn allows me to produce my tonics at a fraction of the cost. I'm doing this for the people. Yeah, okay. So the clan, uh, so the clan orcs starve? The outlying clans. They're enemies of this city and our king. Their chiefs refuse to accept the king's rule. They'd rather stay stuck in their old ways and traditions. Meanwhile, the poor of this city can't afford medicine. I'm saving lives. So the information you passed on costs lives, and the Winterborn supplies, and you gave the uh, Winterborn supplies. A small price to pay for a larger gain. I've been loyal to this city since before you outsiders started arriving. You have no right to judge me. I mean, I'm not really judging you, but when you do something wrong, you gotta pay for it, right? So just tell me where the Winterborn uh, born took the stolen supplies. Fine. What's the use? See what happens when you just try to help? The supplies were sent to Frostbreak Fortress. That's where the Winterborn warlord, Jorfan Iceheart, plans to regroup his forces. I'm sure he's guarding the supplies personally. Should I snitch on him or not? Because he is... He did a really scummy thing, dude. This dude needs to go to prison. Literally stealing supplies that are needed for the subjects of this kingdom. They're all starving and dying. Not to mention to a faction, if you will, that's clearly notoriously known for killing and freezing people. This- I'm sorry. I just- I just talked me into snitching. I'll tell the guard about this. Don't try to leave the city. Do what you will. My tonics are out in the city now. Getting to the people who need them. Sure, I won't be able to enjoy the rest of my gold, but I accomplished what I set out to do. Goodbye. Did I did I miss something? Was did I do the right thing? Because it kind of feels like I didn't for some I don't know why. Was the tonics good? I doubt it. I don't know. I think I missed something, but it's okay. It is what it is. He's going to prison regardless. <laughs> Report to the keep. Oh god, this is where we're going to snitch on him, isn't it? He is so screwed. Get out of my way, Orsinium guard. I can't do anything to you, Once but it's again, okay. again, welcome to Orsinium. I look forward to working with you on this grand endeavor. Hey, we're twins. Look at our backs. Ah, another traveler arrives in our grand city. Welcome, welcome. Are you one of the chosen? Do you bear the letter from the Forge Mother? 
Uh, if you're talking about this one right here, yeah, I have the letter. Who are you, by the way? I am a high priestess of Trinimac, serving in Orsinium's temple. Like you, I'm here at the request of Forge Mother Alga to help revive the ancient traditions of truth, honor, and unity. I also greet new arrivals. Tell me, how is your journey? I mean, it was good, but I helped the caravan that was attacked by Winterbull, uh, by the Winterborn. Supplies for the outlying clans were stolen, though. We've received similar reports. Just one of a series of unfortunate incidents that we plan to rectify. Awesomer soldiers and even the king himself are looking into this. King Korog believes that even those who refuse his rule must be cared for. I like, I like this guy already and I haven't even met him yet. Uh, but I know where they took the supplies, by the way. Truly. <clears throat> Perhaps yeah. we can still recover the supplies the clans need to survive the winter. The decision to invite outsiders to our land has already reaped untold benefits. Tell me, where have the Winterborn hidden the supplies? So... <sighs> yeah. Yeah, Gulag betrayed the clan. I'm still snitching, I don't care. Gulag be, uh, if, if he hadn't, with, with his decision of doing this, of be, of betraying Orsinium and the kingdom, basically, he essentially got, or was gonna get a lot of people killed throughout the winter, so, yeah, I don't feel, I don't feel bad. Gulag betrayed the clans. Uh, he says the supplies were taken to Frost, uh, Break Fortress. You located the stolen supplies and uncovered our betrayer. Trinimac surely sent you to us in our time of need. Take this reward for helping our people. And you must present yourself to Forge Mother Alga. Look, here she comes now. Oh, cool. Thank you. And I got some gold. Is this one of the outsiders who responded to my invitation, High Priestess? Yes, Grand Forge Mother. Thank you, Solgra. I will speak to the outsider. Come, outsider. We have much to discuss. Hello, Forge Mother. 